these new members of our Queensland Police Service are just starting uh, their journey. Um, they're eight weeks old, uh, nine puppies, and they're just about to go out into the brave uh, new world um, with their foster carers. <laughs> From eight weeks of age they go into a foster program and every three days every month they must come back here so we can start their development, uh, their nose work, their bite work and um, the foster carers uh, help us out by socialising the dogs in the big wide world. Queensland Police Service is renowned for its breeding program. You can see the happy little puppies here but uh, they are also of a very high standard and uh, there are a number of jurisdictions around the Asia Pacific who look to the Queensland Police Service dog breeding program for its expertise. Sometimes you see them at around a 12, 16 week old. You can start to tell from that age that oh, this one's he's pretty special. Raptor, Raptor. That's the one I forgot, Raptor. Oh, that's a very serious name, Raptor. Yeah, very serious. One in two dogs that we breed won't make the grade. We, we basically take the best of the best. If they haven't got the, the diver traits in bite work and the aggression, they usually go into family homes because they, they're usually really good tracking dogs. They love chasing the ball. They make good pets. They partner with their long-term partner at around 16 months of age at the start of a police dog training course. And they're with that, that, that handler for the, the remainder of their working career and beyond. Um, nine out of ten dogs that retire at around the eight or nine year old mark stay with the handler. It's a, it's a lifelong commitment from the handler.